Hello, welcome to my channel. My camera just started recording by itself. I didn't even hit record. Odd. Don't mind the way I look. I just got home from the gym and a yoga class. So that's why. Also, I wanted to give you an update. I did use some of the stickers on my nails. Now I'm using these as a practice set. This was a 14 pack. Um, I would always go for more than 14. Um, the first time they didn't seal, I lost three in my first day. Some of them, the top coating peeled off and only took some of the polish or the... And actually, if you peel the top coat off of them, then you actually get a better stick. Like, the actual art is like stuck to your nail. So I maybe thought that was a thing, but... This hand sealed really well, and then this hand didn't. I had two that I had to replace, that's why they're all like, there's more black ones. But I had to use, and I had to cut them. So I just used the rest of the stickers that I had left to cut them down and use them. My mom's having really good luck with the Dashing Diva ones, so I want to keep trying. Then, miracle. I went to the dollar store today to pick up some stuff. We're doing pizza pizza party tonight. And um, I picked up this little thing from the dollar store. This was just in like the checkout lane in the wrong spot, but I just had to have it. It's like a little mason jar. Um, so I'm really excited about that. But then I thought I saw these the other day. Remember when I ordered these off Temu and they weren't mini? I finally found the mini spoons and forks I've been wanting. So I got two packs of forks and a pack of spoons and I am so excited. Like, I should have got two spoons too, but I am going to stock up on these. I just love the mini ones. I just, I don't know why, but when we do like parties and stuff, I like to do like caprese salad with a mini fork in it in little, like little just containers. So anyway, oh, hold on. I forgot a bag. I have a Tamu order for you today. Um, I have two. I don't want this video to be super long because I'm already behind for time. But I got this order and I just didn't think it was enough and I didn't have anything sitting around. So I'm going to put this order in with this big order right here on the floor. So let's jump into this order first. All right. First thing I got were these little clips. And they are nail clips. These were 71 cents and, oh cool. So you put your like fake nail on and then you put this on it and it's supposed to hold it down for you. However, are they I don't, they're not different sizes and the only one it really has pressure on is the thumb. My other fingers are just a little bit too small to feel any kind of pressure on them. So I don't know. We'll see if these work. It came in a set of five, and I, like I said, I think they were 71 cents. Just gives you that extra hold on your nails instead of having to sit there and hold them down. Or, that's what it's supposed to do. Next up, in this order, I had to have this. It was just super cute. It reminds me of my cats. My big cat just absolutely loves knives for some reason. He's drawn to the shininess must be. It did come with an extra back in the package, but yeah, super in love with that. I'm actually just going to throw the extra back away. Another set of nails, cute little drips, and oh, the hearts are 3D. We all know how I like my 3D nail stuff. I'm not going to open this. This is just another travel bag like I showed you last time. This was a really small order. So, the next, I have two of these black packages. I don't remember what's in them. Oh! These are so cute. So, it's like a little spatula on the end. Well, and then the crystal thing, but you're supposed to be able to put it in like your eye cream and just... I know this is for your face. The other little thing could be a cat brush, but, and I did get two of them. So that's what's in here. Oh man, this stuff is nasty sticky. 
so I did got crystal and then this one is jade and these were I think a dollar 88 a piece I have just been so obsessed with these little minis so there they are okay we gotta open this big bag now there are some things in here that I am so excited about so I was like I gotta get in and film before I go shower for the our get together tonight So, all right. Oh, this is cute. I forgot I got this. This was like two dollars and something cents. Um, I really wanted to see it. I don't know what I was expecting. I actually expected it to be smaller than this, but it's this little tiny bag, and it zips open. Oh my gosh, this is so much cuter than I thought. And it has that just to keep its shape. And then it's just a little cylinder, I'm going to put that back for now, it's just a little cylinder tube and I got this, they had tons of colors and patterns, I just happened to get this pink with like the stars on it, Vogue New Famous it says, and then it has this little thing, so this must like hook on your keys or something, I'm not even sure if it said a use for it on the site, but for like two dollars I thought this was super cute, in fact it might like fit a pill bottle perfect, so if you're traveling and you have pills, that would probably be perfect for it. Oh, I'm so disappointed. Okay, so I got these and I asked my boyfriend if I should and they both agreed. And they're not at all what I thought they would be. So this is supposed to be a hamburger holder. And I thought it was supposed to accordion so you could fit like the size of your burger, like whatever size your burger was. I thought these would like snap kind of and you can make it smaller and thinner because we don't do a bun so a lot of that is not going to take up room we were going to put lettuce in there and put the bun and all the toppings and then be able to eat it but these are a lot flimsier and I paid $2.88 for these and right now they are way cheaper so if you want them they do sit well but uh yeah not 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 a fan I have two of them but not a fan of that structure next I'm trying to switch in my order so there was more variety and things next I got this little brush um I reuse my kombucha bottles and put tea in them and then my boyfriend cut holes in the lid and so a straw goes down in them and I thought this would be perfect to like get inside and wash it. It's thinner than the other one. We have a big like fluffy brush and I stick that down in there but this will be a lot easier and I have one to wash now so yay! Next up I got this to go with my traveling stuff. Same idea as like these little foot travel bags but this one is specifically for like your cosmetics. So it's folded and it actually feels like it has a bottom in it. Oh, it has a thing in it. So this is just for like your toiletries and makeup when you travel. So I thought this would be cute and match everything else. So it's going to be in my travel bag. So these together. I think I'm going to try to put a makeup thing together and just leave it in there. Oh, I meant to grab my glasses before I show this. Let me see. I think I have sunglasses. I'm just looking for something. Okay. I need a pair of glasses. Okay. I actually thought this was going to be my next order, so this is so exciting. Okay, so this is a sloth, and he has a little back, and you stick this in his face. I don't know why he has a feather. And then it holds... It 
it holds your glasses. Maybe you're supposed to put it there. So the glasses sit on his little nose. So in the picture, this was a lot different. It looked more cartoony than it actually is. I actually also did not expect it to be wood. I expected this to be like a very cheap foam. I didn't know if it was going to work for sure, but then it just sits on your desk. And I have my, I have the pair of eyeglasses that I have all the toppings to. So I'm going to set this in my bathroom with that and uh, put my glasses on it. Oh. Oh, and then that goes on it so it doesn't slide through. I didn't know that piece was in there. So now I just put this little piece comes separate. So I just put it on the stick. Stick the stick through the hole in his face. And there you go. In love with it. Alright. Oh, up next. Okay, they tricked me, which is totally fine. So I got this little organizer for my bathroom. And you just... Alright, so they don't pop up, but you just push these in and it disconnects. But I got this for like hair ties and bobby pins in my bathroom drawer. Now they had two of these, like two different sellers. Is there something... Oh. I don't know what these are for, but it does have little two little plastic pieces in it. I'll have to see what those are for. Like maybe it goes in here. Anyway, I'm not gonna mess with it. But so I got the option that actually came with the stickers to decorate it. So you just put these on here, and then you got a whole whole bin. All decorated. Okay, let's move along a little bit faster pace, maybe. Oh, this is eyebrow tint. This is called Brow Tastic Popo Candy Eyebrow Tint. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah, I did want to try this brush. So, Ooh. It's a weird brush, but it might work exactly how I want it to. It feels like a waxy kind of consistency, and it doesn't give off much color. I don't know. I'm going to keep trying it. It's a cute packaging. It doesn't really give off a lot of color, but it might be good to like use that as a blender. Like once I get my makeup on, maybe tone them down a little bit with that. Okay. This is like a hook of some kind. And you like, you stick it around a pole and then you have like a hook. And I got this for the camper, I think. I just have to see in the picture what it is and then I'll be able to decide where you use it, but I'm pretty sure it's for camping. Oh, I got this for my computer, and I got it in gray. They had a lot of colors, but I got it in gray for my Chromebook, but in case I didn't like it, I got a neutral color so that my boyfriend could use it, but inside it has a little pocket, so I'm going to just stick my Chromebook in there, and then it has a little handle. Nothing too exciting there. Uh, these are nails. I don't know why I would order these. I'm pretty sure they were pictured differently. And I think these were $1.88. I think I know exactly where they came from. But... <gasps> I'm so happy I bought this. I've been debating on buying this. I didn't know I already had. So this is an electronic baby whack-a-mole machine. And I think this was $0.39. Cents. Oh, well, no, it had a... Oh, 
Okay, I pulled out the tab from the back so it has a battery and it makes sound, but it doesn't work. But the buttons are super fun. It says, uh, guess where I am, but none of my, I've held it down, none of the buttons work. So I'm gonna have to open it up and see, oh! Oh my gosh, it's on. This is hours of fun, guys. It makes a lot of noise. You just hold down the button. Okay. It's gonna, whack and all is my favorite game. Oh! Yes! Okay, I got this bag of clips. I think it's a hundred pieces. Yeah, a hundred pieces. These are balloon clips. So you blow up your balloon and then instead of tying it, you take this and clasp it on the and it connects. I don't I just I think once you connect it, you can't get it back open. So I don't want to waste one. But Anyway, you put your balloon in there. I wish I would have brought a balloon. Then I could see if they actually work. They're really hard to push. Yeah, I think it's gonna work. Those are cool. And like I said, I think it's just one time use. I, not that I'm gonna go pop all the balloons and collect these, but I'm just going to throw it away. I have no idea what that is. Oh, okay. Yes, I do. This is for camping too. I'm not going to open it, but it is a dome that you put over your food so that the bugs don't get into it when you're camping. So if we have like something sitting out, we can just put this over the top of them and then the bugs and stuff won't get in. And I think it'll stop a lot of the dirt. So if you're a camper, I'll let you know how this works when we go. We're starting to get our camping trips planned. This, I'm so excited it's here for tonight. This is a shot dispenser. So, this sits like this, and you put your cups, it pours six shots, you put your cups in there, like your little shot glasses, and then each one is to a pour, and you just pour your alcohol in the top, and it distributes into the cups. So, I'm not a drinker, but we do have a whole basement centered around, it looks like a bar down there, and we have a full bar. So I thought this would be super cute for pouring shots. Um, now, don't get me wrong, I will pour shots for people. I just don't take them. Okay. I'm excited about that item too. Okay. This, once again, is for my eyebrows. And I was hoping it'd be a little bit denser, but you're supposed to be able to just like brush through your eyebrows and it's supposed to set your eyebrows. But I thought it would be good for blending as well. And it is this like just tapered brush. And it's just long on one side. There you go. And then just short on the other. This was, I think, $1.71. You might want to look around, see if they have a better price for more. They might. Sometimes I notice too that like after I click on a product, it'll just tell me automatically if they go on a lightning deal if I've already viewed it. Something to keep in mind. Then this one is just like a little eyeliner brush. I could, let me just put my hand in front of it. It's flimsy and then it came with this little mushroom topper one and another little brush on the end. Don't know quite what I'm gonna use those for, but I'm sure I'll be able to find something to use them for. Oh, these are some more brushes as well. Um, this is another one like that red one, but it's thinner. So these are not what I expected at all. 
and maybe I'm just wrong, but I thought this one would be, it's like so, so tiny. I thought it would be really cute for like hard lines on your eyebrow or liner. So really excited. There's of course more brushes. These are the ones, okay, so these are both different. So that set, okay, now I'm happier with it. This was a set of two. And it is a thin, like, crease brush that's, like, rounded. Anyway, they are called, like, sickle brushes. So I did get a couple of those. And then this is another pack of the little brushes that I just showed. Oh, this is a little gadget that's supposed to mince garlic. And we've been using so much garlic lately. Okay, so it has like two little things and then I think you just put it in and spin it. Like it's a manual one and I knew that it was less than a dollar, but you're supposed to put your garlic in there and then maybe you just smash it. And it has a picture of a little garlic on this side. So for the kitchen, cute. Okay, that's to this product I'm trying to wait till last to show. What are you? Oh! Okay, I just really wanted to see these. I'm really happy they came in this order. I can't believe it. I'm really bad at customer service phone calls because like I sit in silence for all the periods of time. Okay. Whew. Those are not closed up on the sides, so these are just many of those little boxes that have the bouncy stuff. So I thought these would be cute for um like just single earrings or like stud earrings. You could fit like four pairs in there. But this was a pack of 10 for $4.99, and this is the littlest one. Um, you can get other sizes in a pack of 10. Um, I just wanted to see how they were, and it's more expensive as the sizes get bigger, so. I feel like, where am I? Okay. Oh, next. Okay. I got really fun stuff in this order. I'm very excited. So these are for gardening and like with gardening season coming up and you can get these in different ways but this is a glove that you can it gives you like nails so you can dig into the dirt or you can be freddy and the tips are plastic and my fingers are just in there so when I'm planting Came with two gloves, you can actually get them in with different numbers of these things for your hand. They smell not good, but they only had one color, but you could get like two claws or eight claws. So I got eight. Yes, the thumb does not have one. This is the other burger holder that I'm not gonna open. Okay. Oh my gosh, that thing just fell. I should just show it. All right, next up, I don't want to open this. This is so weird though. It's not like in any packaging or anything. It It is sealed though. But this is an eyeliner adhesive gel or mask or eyeliner for like it's the glue. So I just got it in a liner. Oh, these are little magnets and I'm so disappointed. So I wasn't gonna buy these. I went back and forth, back and forth. They're scarf magnets. But I had the perfect use for one of these just the other day, and now I cannot remember what it is. So I went ahead and picked them up. It's a four pack, and this is a strong magnet. Like, this is going to hold your scarf, but they are intentionally made for scarves to hold them together. And I'll tell you what, if you need a strong magnet, for some reason I had something else that I was going to do with these, and when it comes to me, I will let you know. But I did get a four pack of the scarf magnet. Okay. All right, we're down to two items, and these ones are fun. So, 
this little box is a five piece sunglass holder. So look at my sunglasses again. So you put your sunglasses in and then it folds into this like hectagon. And I thought this would be perfect. Like we have some trips coming up this summer, like Lake Tahoe and things. And I was like, this will be perfect because me and my boyfriend both wear glasses. So we can pack a pair of glasses. He can pack two pairs of sunglasses. I always forget to wear sunglasses, so I can just pack the one. And we can even like not our glasses. Like we have multiple pairs of glasses, but not to the extent where we could keep one in here. I do actually. But like I'll put my Ray-Bans in here and then they are transition lenses so they will switch or they'll be like sunglasses too. So how awesome. I love I love that it hangs too like once it's open like we could just get there hang this on the wall and there you have it. Hopefully I got the hooks that I was trying to order sticky hooks. So this is really cool. I'm like really excited about this. And then this last item here in the box, it fell out. It's a mug. I paid $8 for this, so I'm really excited to see how it works. But it actually tells you when you touch the lid, what temperature your drink is inside or what temperature it is inside your cup. So it has this little thing, you could probably put tea in it and diffuse it, but it goes on top and it just sits in there, it's like a little basket. And then this is the sensor part, and I'm going to take this sticker off. For $8, I thought this was so cool, and they didn't have very many colors, like luckily they had this one left, otherwise it was like just black, but then you just tap on there and it tells you that inside temperature is 17 degrees. So it tells you if your drink is drinkable or if it's going to be like cold or hot all by just pressing the top. Oh my gosh, I'm so in love with this and this is BPA free, hand wash only. Like I think I'm gonna use this today. I'm gonna go wash it. So that's everything. I feel like we did a rush through, but oh my gosh. Anyway, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like any of these products, like my new cup. I'll post a picture too with this video when I put something inside of it and see if the temperature actually rises. Then maybe we can like add some ice and then see again. Right now it's 17 degrees inside. Anyway. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel and give it a thumbs up if you liked it, leave me a comment. I love to to interact with you guys on comments. So thanks guys. See you next time.